Hey everybody, welcome back to another edition of 8 at 8 with me. Uh, today we're going to focus on the abs and I'd like for you to grab something with a little bit of heft or weight. Uh, you'll see down here I've got a medicine ball, it's 6 pounds, I've got a 4 pound weight, or if you don't have weights and you don't have a medicine ball, grab a water bottle and fill it up, okay? The key here is to fill it up, right? Not just an empty water bottle, but just a little bit of uh, weight. Now, if you can't have weight and you wanna do it without any weight, that's okay. What we're gonna do today is something I'm calling give me five, all right? I do have it as weighted, and we're gonna do it as a circuit. It'll be Russian twists, under the leg pass, and then we're gonna reverse the direction. We're gonna do scissor passes around the backs. We're gonna reverse that direction, and a chest pass. So uh, that'll be the, the progression as we go through. Then we'll take a break and then we'll go through it again. So um, the, the why they give me five is because we're gonna do five reps of each of these exercises while we do it. Hopefully you'll feel the burn and let's get to it. All right, so um, now whether you're using a medicine ball, a weight or a water bottle, you're gonna be passing it through or around your back to yourself, right? You do not need a partner for this, okay? I'm gonna start with the medicine ball. Oh, and you'll notice I don't have shoes on today because my, my feet, <laughs> they're gonna be hanging for a while. So, all right, so Russian twists, here we go. I actually touch it to the ground, okay? And it's five to each side. Now we're going under the legs. One, two, three, four, five. Now we switch directions. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna do the scissor legs. So it was five each way. Feet are still off the ground. Then we go around the back. This one's a little bit, gonna require a little bit of flexibility. One, two, three, four, five. And then we switch direction. One, two, three, four, five. And then lastly, we do a chest pass. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh. Okay. You notice the burn in the abs and actually on your upper thighs. And then you want to try to work on that flexibility uh, to do the back passes and, um, and around the legs. So this is going to require some agility, flexibility, and of course, ab strength. All right, so let's go do another round. This time a little bit quicker. And we'll see how it goes. So if you have something a little bit oblong in shape, the pass might be... Um, a little awkward at times, but you'll get the hang of it. All right, here we go. Russian twists. Chest pass as well. Oh, good one. All right. So now, when you do this, um, as we go along and you get stronger and stronger and you want to do a series of this, you can grow the number of uh, repetitions for each one. You can start with five, you can build to 10, you can go to 20, you can get as high as you'd like. So um, we'll go another round here and uh, let's check them out. Russian twist, here we go. Six, nine, ten. Under legs. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Did ten. So I'll go to a ten the 
the way. Round the back. Other way. Chest pass. Okay. Yeah. So you'll notice on all those, I have my feet elevated. Now, if elevating your feet is just a little too difficult, then you can obviously put your feet on the ground. Um, the goal is to get your feet off the ground. If you wanted to add a little bit more difficulty, throw on some shoes. You'll notice that when you put weight uh, somewhere that's away from the center of mass on your body, it actually makes it harder. So throw on some shoes, make it more difficult. You can add in reps, make it more difficult. Um, yeah, so there you have it. This was our our session. Oh, oh my, my uh, I've gotten some really great feedback on the kit. This is our kit for camp in Chula Vista. And uh, I think it turned out great. It looks awesome. Um, let's see if I can't rep out one more round for you for our eight at eight. Okay, here we go. So, run, rush and twist. Under the pass, one, two, three, four, five, switch, one, two, three, four, five, scissors. off the ground pretty difficult. I think that was six. One, two, three. Boom. That's how we roll. I don't know how many times I did that. But it's good to have a workout. You feel the burn. You can take a break in between. If you want to add it and make it a little more difficult, you keep on rolling. So that's our eight of eight. Hope you guys enjoy it. Um, feel free to make adaptations and, and adjustments to it to make it fit your speed, your strength, your flexibility for where you are right now. You can do that by changing up the load, the weights in your hands. Um, you can get a heavier weight if you'd like. Uh, you can put on shoes, up the reps, all that good stuff. But um, just get after it, have a good one, and we'll see you at the races. Later.